What up, good people? Today is Two Minute Tip Tuesday. Let's get into this video. So, today we're going to talk about three ways of preventing your vehicle from overheating. So, the first way is turn off the AC if you're starting to see your uh, vehicle overheat. Turn off the AC, and yeah, you probably like, yo, already speed, I'm not turning off the AC. The car just going to have to do what it had to do. No, you don't want that problems because uh, more problems than a little bit. Turn off the AC, roll down all the windows, crank up your uh, heat. Yes, the reason why I'm telling you to crank up the heat is because you're going to be pulling all that heat from the engine bay into the cockpit because you don't want to uh, create more problems than a little bit and you want to try to cool that engine down quick as possible because you don't have no antifreeze and the car is overheating. And then most vehicles nowadays, it will tell you to pull over emergency quick pull the vehicle over because yeah the car is overheating some vehicles even cut the vehicle off so if you got one of those new vehicles yeah your vehicle gonna be cut off if your car started overheating the next one is pop the hood of the vehicle you're gonna look in your reservoir or your uh overflow tank whatever you want to call it um and see if you got antifreeze so antifreeze is like different colors pink orange blue green you know these type of colors, they're gonna look a little colorful and you're gonna see, if you do not see no type of color in your um, reservoir or your overflow tank, yes, hurry up, go to your local auto zone, make sure you figure out, ask them, hey, this is the year making model and they can give you the correct antifreeze for your vehicle because yeah, you don't wanna mix the antifreeze too because we'll talk about that in another video of mixing antifreeze, but yeah. The third one is, I do this all the time is check your gauges. The only reason why I check my gauges now is because my car overheated plenty of times. I'm not going to say in front. Um, and I was like, yo, so it's like a habit of me, like making sure all my gauges, everything is good. So I make sure I check my engine temp gauge and make sure it's not creeping up, but it should be at a normal um, gauge. Some vehicles got different types of uh, where it need to be at. But if it's starting to creep all the way up to the H, yeah, pull the vehicle over and yeah, turn off the vehicle and let the vehicle cool itself down. It may take a while to cool itself down because it's hot outside and the engine is hot. So it may take a while, but pull the vehicle over, make sure you're safe or anywhere and pull the vehicle over, pop the hood, let the engine cool off. But if you think this video helpful, go ahead and smash that thumbs up button. If you're not part of the RSP fam, go ahead and that subscribe button. Yo, welcome to the family. I look forward to seeing you next video.